Hi everybody, it's me, Candy Corpse, and I know I took another break, I'm sorry. I started back to school this past month, and so I've been really busy getting back into the hang of that and stuff, and plus I didn't really buy a whole bunch of stuff in August, so there was no point in me doing a month of August haul video. But I'm back with a month of September haul video for you guys. But yeah, I just wanted to apologize. I started my sophomore year of college, so I've been busy moving back into my dorm room and stuff like that. I may do a dorm tour if you guys are interested in that at some point. You just let me know. But without further ado, let's get on with the stuff I got this month. Yay! Oh. The first things I got this month were um, these Vampirella comic books. Um, I didn't get all of the issues. I got issues 1, 3, and 5. And the reason I got 1, 3, and 5 were because um, the comic book store where I get my comics and stuff at didn't um, have that many of these issues and then I realized that the inside art wasn't the same as the cover art and I wasn't really the, that fond of the style that um, the inside art has so I was just like meh. But they're still pretty good. They're not terrible comics. They're just not really my thing. Um, the next things I got were some stuff at the thrift store. I got this Silly Trolls VHS tape, and the reason I got it was because it was something I used to enjoy as a child, and I was really sort of excited to find it and stuff. But yeah, it's called The Magic Trolls and the Troll Warriors. <laughs> um, I also got this little pumpkin stress ball at the thrift store, and... These really, really cute plushies. This little Frankenstein plushie. And this cute little witch plushie. And a little bat, because you know I love bats. I'm a sucker for bats. And the ghost. Ghosty. Yay. And like the thrift store where I go to was having like a 50 person off sale, so that was really, really nice. So I got it all for like um, $5, I think. But I think it was at. I got some other stuff too, but it wasn't for me, it was for my boyfriend, so yeah. So, on Vard, oh, wait. I also got this little coffin box at the thrift store. See, it opens up. So I was really excited about that because I've been wanting a coffin box for a while. And this cute little snow globe that has jack-o'-lanterns and a black hat in it. So yay for thrift stores. Well, the next things I got were some pops because I, I, I went pop crazy this month, you guys. Like, I don't think I've ever bought this many pops pops in one month in all my life, but they had labyrinth pops come out. More labyrinth pops. This is Ludo and Sarah and the worm, which was really the only reason I got Sarah. I know this is like really awkward way of doing videos. I'm sorry, this is like one of the only ways I can like do it is by having my camera perched up on my TV. <laughs> oh, but um, then I got some Dark Crystal Pops because I'm in love with the Dark Crystal. It's one of my favorite movies. Um, I got Ultra, who is fantastic and probably my favorite character in that movie. And I got, um, Ursal the Mystic, and he's like really nice, you guys, like, he's really, really heavy for a pop, and really well detailed. I'm gonna do a, probably a bigger video on these guys at once, at some point, like I did with my Jareth pop, but for now this'll do, and I got, um, what is his name? 
Anyways, I got one of the Skeksis, because I love Skeksis. Um, I don't really plan on getting, um, either of the gel things, because I wasn't really that interested in them for real. I'm more interested in the creatures, unless I can find, like, one with the variant Fizzkid, because I'm all for the variant Fizzkid. <laughs> Oh, but yeah, I do plan on getting the Hoggle Pop and the other Jareth Pop at some point. I just haven't been able to find a Hoggle Pop that's in decent condition yet, but yeah. Uh, um, the next thing I got was this book called The Traveling Vampire Show by Richard Lehman. Um, I'm really excited to read this because it's been on my Goodreads wish list for a well not wish list but my Goodreads to read list for a while now so I'm excited to have finally picked it up. I also got a couple of films. I got um, the movie Innocent Blood which I wasn't all that fond of but I'm going to try and give it another chance. I'm just it just really wasn't my cup of tea. Cup of tea. And I also got the film It Follows, and this fancy stillbook edition, and it's like really nice and stuff, especially for like a new movie. Um, I got it for like $10 at Walmart too, which is a steal for stillbook edition, editions. But um, I actually wasn't all that fond of it, to be honest. Like, I thought the idea was really, really interesting, however, like, I don't know. I thought I did I wasn't really that fond of the actors in it and I thought the cinematography was sort of shit because I'm really into like really beautiful stunning cinematography and I thought this was pretty just you know standard I don't know it just didn't blow me away like I thought it was going to but it's not a bad movie it's just not a great one but yeah that concludes my haul for this month I believe um that's all you guys, um, so, I guess it's time for me to just go do homework or some shit like that. <laughs> Bye.